So this all started because I wanted to appreciate some friends. So I wanted to make something that would be really unique, that I could give to, to my friends, that would make them feel special, and hopefully people would have to ask about them and be like, what is that thing on your wrist? I started out working with an industrial design group called Tool. That came up with this one, and then we modified this one to come up with this one, and from there, everything else sort of cascaded from the design there. The aesthetics for this are my aesthetics. So I spent a lot of time when I was running a 3D printer company dealing with triangles. Every model that you make on a 3D printer is made up of triangles. And I'm a child of like the Lamborghini Countach and DeLorean age. So I love this folded paper aesthetic. So one of the advantages we have over everybody else in the world probably is like, I just have all the 3D printers. So we can have an idea and by the end of the day, we can have multiple iterations of it. And so the design part of it is really fast for us. And then we got to the point where we're like, okay, here it is. Let's go find a partner to help us make it. As I started to think about how to make a watch, I tried to figure out how to get a movement. So I ended up going to Basel World and met with Eterna and really liked them. And so what we've got now is the Eterna 3909A movement in here, which is just a standard hours, minutes, seconds, date movement. So we've got the case. This is machined by our friends in Kansas City, Berger and Brown. They have a background of doing precision machinery in the silicon chip fabrication component fixture world. And then the bolts are just sort of classic M3 bolts. The band, we worked with Stern Rubber, which is in Minnesota. The crown is custom from Pibor, which is a Swiss company. They're great to work with. Right now we've got a aluminum dial, and then we have a brass chapter ring, and then we're applying the loom ourselves. In designing the watch, I wanted it to be really special. I wanted it to be a gold medal of friendship. And so it's got a gold coin on the back, and it's the, it's the American Eagle, and it's got Lady Liberty on it, and it's the most beautiful coin minted today. Originally, I was going to make 12 watches, and now shifted that up to our first edition, our first series is 100 watches. We're making 100 of this watch. And then we have all sorts of ideas for ways to explore what happens next. I want to explore coatings, I want to explore different materials, I want to explore different designs, and then eventually I want to do a chronograph and a diver. You know, I'm not planning on competing with Rolex or Patek, I'm just trying to make something really special that's unique, iconic, that makes the people who wear it feel really special.